Almost home. Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. If we could find a way to open Rome travel to Spartalfarm, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us. Enough. We will go. Really? But if we do not fight here, you will abandon your search for good. All right. You won't be sorry. Hmm? Breed. Is that Atreus? It's been so long. <gasps> How you've grown. <laughs> uh, oh, <well>, yeah. <sighs> well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned he needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. Brother, I think we both know it's not safe here. Hate to say it, but we should talk to Sindri. After you, my friends. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <clears throat> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, we've settled here in the Realm Between Realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimblewinter. Safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any, anybody need a snack? Kratos, snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's, what? It it's okay, I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son disobey me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so fast. 
How'd that get in here? What the hell is it anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happened to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. I blame you. Now, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits, at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey, I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivanting. Begin with this. Mmm. Busted up good. Hm. Wouldn't I just whip you up a new one? Important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, I fix you up with something to get you by. I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new duds.
Looks like Fimble Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's overdue for some rock. Found some items you left behind. Tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around. I got my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. This place is great, Sindri. You built it all yourself? You know it. See? I knew you wanted a snack. What'll it be? Need something special? No. Refunds. And how's life been treating everyone's favorite as your vulgarian? The fuck you call me? <laughs> Exquisite. Hey, come see. I guess this is where they store the food. 
Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Finding everything all right, I hope? How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew Mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader, Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember Atreus. things how it... All right, see you out there, Sindri. You hear that? We'll just need the Bifrost and the head, Brock. Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a sodding bastard! Oh! Ha, 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 Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh! That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release! Still on poison. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Russell goes, eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just <gasps> there! That should do it. <sighs> see? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Kratos! Throw me at him! Horns first! <laughs> Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first... Come on, let me show you how it works. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. That's Midgard in the middle. I know you're... I'm back there anytime soon. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! Oh. Whoa, do you feel that? What's that, lad? Anything. Everything. It's warm. 
We can probably use his boat. If I can just get it free. Careful, lad. Why are these things so fast? already off to a lively start. Atreus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have caught that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. They are resources. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. Uh, did you see that over there? Channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know, it is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. 
Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Oh, I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. <laughs> Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Raid Mars Brasser, father of a few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Rock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. Come on, there's got to be a faster way to get down there.
Okay, there's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. What there? Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartelheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Oh, wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartofan? I lie. <laughs> Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Think we can fit under that bridge? Father, there.
Find anything good up there?
they cap those guys? Uh. Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. He froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? <gasps> yes! The wheel's moving and the gate's coming down. That's more of an ingenuity for ya. Back to the boat. The dwarves of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri. It's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned.
you really think Odin would honor his end of the deal? That if we keep our distance, he'll leave us alone? No. That does not mean I intend to fight him. Perhaps we find a new home, where neither he nor Freya can trouble us. But once we find Tyr, he can help us fight. Fight? That's, uh, not what I meant. Obviously, we have so much to learn from Tyr. Any way he can help us is good, right? Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Did it. Let's see what it drops. <laughs> Halfway there. There's gotta be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. It's taking too long! We gotta knock it down! Can uncover that geyser from here. Hmm. Oh, I 
think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. <laughs> Get to it. <laughs> Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. I still don't see how we can get up to that chain. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Try hitting the rope holding the block. Yeah. Nice one. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Yeah. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. <laughs> Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Hmm. Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as my... Proof Tear is truly here. Right. <sighs> that earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. 
Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. It only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. How's that for us, though? They are scared. Was definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Talk to we you for don't want any trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. 